today we're at the Reading offices of Shoesmiths who have kindly hosted the launch of the Ethical Reading Code of Ethics and we've been running an event called Building Great Workplaces. Being a Reading girl, ethical Reading is something that is really close to my heart. So having a code of ethics that we can take out to all businesses in the region and let them use as a blueprint is a really useful practical tool to make Reading and the Thames Valley a more prosperous place for all of us to live and work. What we want to do is to be a community leader and encourage everybody that's involved to act and think ethically in how they go about their business so we can build a town we're really proud of. I think if you're an SME and you're saying, I don't know anything about this, how do, how do I do this as a business? I haven't got time, I haven't got the budget, how do I build this in? I think the work and the resources that Ethical Reading do will be extremely useful. My view is that if you're not ethical, you probably won't be in business in, in 10 years. The companies that are putting people first, are putting the planet first, will be the ones that are actually starting to make more profit than those less ethical companies. I think that um, the work that Ethical Reading does is fantastic, which is why we've joined it as a, a, a partner. I particularly like the code of ethics that they're producing because organisations have got so many things that they're looking at and want to do. Uh, to have this uh, that they can use as a starting point uh, it is a fantastic thing. Today's event was absolutely brilliant. It's so good to be surrounded by like-minded individuals that care deeply about ethics in business. We've had a lot of positive feedback, which has been excellent. A lot of people expressing interest in adopting or utilising the code of ethics. And I'm really excited to get the opportunity to be working with these companies going forward to think about what this is going to look like in action.